Starting off tomorrow's vlog early purely because Amy's got me a nice present. She's putting one on her car, putting one on my bike as well. Where should I put it? Uh, yeah, about there. But people are going to see that. Should it not go? Yeah, put it there, why not? And I've also got one to put on my bike, so. Oh, so as the wife is amazing, she's um, put it on her car, and because I have no nails, she's currently put it in uh, another one on my bike. So, I'll show you the finished product. Guys, yeah, the moment of truth. Ta da! That looks so slick. Oh, mate. The fuck with scratches, that's, that's my thing. You can run your finger over it, it's just a sticker. <laughs> I love you so much. Oh, guys. Well, I just had to say you're very productive today. Um, it is currently five to nine in the morning. Yeah, it's early. And I'm actually going to my mother's for a little while to see how she is, because obviously, well, you guys don't know this, but somehow whilst walking, her knee gave way. So, we're going to see how she is. But I'm going to be back here for 11.30 because I'm uh, doing Amy lunch for her work break, and then I'm meeting Amy down at her work. <sighs> Basically, just a lot of shit's happening today. And if you think, if you if if I didn't tell you Friday Friday's gonna be a very good vlog. I don't know if I've told you what's happening in Friday's vlog, but Friday Saturday Sunday I'm vlogging because I've got three days off in a row. So stay tuned. Um, but I can't film now because obviously it's gonna be kids in that playing. Um, mother injured her knee, but she's still driving like an utter because she just doesn't give a <laughs> shit. Burst. So um, yeah, going there. Me and Kate and Tony there with Spencer. Obviously, like I said, can't film now, but I'll film after it. And um, when we come back, I'll show you Tony's new bike, so. It was amazing fun at Jump Street with uh, Spence and my sister, brother and my mother. You know, it was pretty good fun. And um, I forgot to show a video of Tony's bike, but he's got, uh, I think he sent me a picture of it. So I'll throw that in it as a vlog. But um, today, um, she's doing nothing now. I'm meeting Amy at uh, one pocket at her work, which is 45 minutes, I need to do her some lunch. And then after that, Come back here. Also, I need to bring up a place to see if they can replace my brakes. So I've just been on the phone to the place who I'm going to get my bike taken to to replace my brake pads. Um, but apparently they got order it in, which you know it's not a problem at all. Um, go down there after I've been with Amy, so I'll be done about quarter past two. The guys, are all day does the brake pads, so bring them up. Super nice, super cool, and um, super cheap per hour. Normal place costs like 70, 70 quid. They charge per hour, 35 quid I think he said it was. So, it's something that's got to be done, it's got to be done. I'm just currently going to make Amy her lunch and then take it down to her, spend some time with her. Then when she goes back to work, I'll be going down to Pro Bike. It's a place called Pro Bike. Um, it's where I actually done my CBT. Uh, so, I'll be going there and see how much it costs. So, I just realised I can't go down to Pro Bike because um, I have no money and they want a deposit. So. <laughs> Uh, I'll be going down uh, on payday, <laughs> or somewhere around payday. So totally difficult, I have no money. Well, I do have money, but it's for bills and shit, so I can't exactly go to someone and be like, yeah, have £100. And I'm like, oh shit, sorry, I gave that your £100 to that person, so. Yeah, I'm not going down there, so. <laughs> I'm a drip. <laughs> a legitimate drip. <laughs> Never mind. But yeah. Yes, me. For Amy's lunch, I have one set tuna clam, some pasta, bam. All I need is mayonnaise and ham. Set tuna clam, set pasta, and the final ingredient, mayonnaise. All together, tuna pasta salad. Pasta is boiling. If you don't know what that fucking noise is, it is, for some reason my torch is on, but fuck it, it is that. Leave it up to that. And I've got a whopping 20 ish minutes to make this. Go down to Amy, and then it's frothy. Frothy! It's a cookie with Ben. Woo hoo! Um, welcome to the Cooking with Ben show. Yes, I am sweating like fat because I've been trying to like a head of chicken, but once again, it's going to boil over. One minute. Go down, there we go, just cooking up the pasta for my wife. And then, uh, yeah. Scrumptious! I don't know what the fuck to do with it yet. Yeah, I've literally got a whole walk in 20 minutes to get this done. Cool it down and um, 
That's just the way the cookie crumbles and uh hey, that's very What is what with English weather? Seriously, cool down, I'm too hot. Did it not me? You wanted to just go a bit of trim so last on the last clip, it's been five minutes and um Yeah, I've got fifteen minutes. <laughs> Uh, pardon me, really pardon me. That was gassy. But, uh, party finished from the shit, but. Casta? Casta? Pasta is still cooking. And, um, do you like my little lizard? We're gonna do the, the camera. <laughs> um, I'm gonna put epilepsy, epilepsy, epilepsy warning on this video now, because I've done that, so. Be sorry! Um, yeah, cause I don't want anybody to watch my videos and have a fit and blame me for it, so... Oh, I might just edit that bit out of the clip. So, yeah. It's all completed. It's in this little tub. I've left the lid off a little bit, so any excess steam can, you know, pssst out. And then, um, we're going to see Amy. And then, uh, yeah, that's pretty much my day, I think. Um, actually, I need to watch Syndicate's vlog. I was watching last night, but it wasn't actually uploaded to like whatever time this morning, so. Yay. My nose, my nostrils are so fucking big. So take, take no notice of my nostrils, and um, I'll see you soon, okay? Bye! I'm going to go to see one, I just need to lock up. And, uh, just, just hope I get this to her in one piece, so. So I'm here, four before her lunch break starts, and it made it in one piece, so very, very happy with that. As it is now, I'm just waiting for a bloke to come back, because he's come, gone out to get some parts for whatnot, go for him to come back, and then I'll get a quote on how much it costs to change my rear brake break pad. And I'm also going to ask him how I can do I'm also going to ask him how I can remove this, this one around it, so... I've just been thinking, like, you know, go for YouTube, this and Right, I want you guys to give me a challenge. I want you to tell me what I, you think I could do better with my vlogs and what isn't that great. And, <coughs> pardon me. Um, yeah, but there is a new addition to my bike that I started off this vlog last night, early for it. But, um, I'll go and show you quickly again. Right. That, that could be red, but Amy got for me. So, YouTube play bad. My YouTube name is so sick. Oh, love it so much. Amy has also got one on her car. So, it's a cool thing. People want to work, like, you have a YouTube channel. Yeah? Why? That was really slow. Intense motion. And, um, I'm like, yeah, why? They looked at it like, you're a twat. Thanks. Yeah. Thing is, with me, I am who I am. I'll film whatever happens in my day. Obviously, so I went to Jump Street where there was like a shit ton of kids about, so I couldn't exactly film there because people were like, Why are you filming my child? Like that, so couldn't film. Even though I had great fun with her, Spencer, you know. Listen, anyway, hopefully, in a few weeks' time, I'll be taking the wife to Jump Street with um, Spencer so she can have a little play around and shit. Yeah. People say to me, You need to like up. No, um, what's the word I'm looking for? I like make your vlogs more interesting. That is fine, everybody's welcome to our opinion, but when you have no money and nothing to do, what can I do? Like, I'm trying guys, I just, I need your guys' help to tell me what I can do to make these vlogs more interesting. Even though this is, this clip's becoming one minute 10, so I need to stop it and, sunshine-ish. Right guys. Mind me being extremely sweaty and sorry was on my screen. Right, there's, I'm doing a little segment here because there's one thing I want to get off my chest and one thing that loads of people have been asking me and even my wife doesn't really know what this one about to say. Now, since me and I have been together, we've been together three years, nearly eight months. People have said to me, why did you get married so young? The most simplest answer is, one, I've... Literally, like she's the love of my life. Two, can't imagine my life without her. Three, when you know you've met the right person, just get married. Well, not just get married, obviously, you're like, you know, this, that, anyway. But so many people always say to me, you must be like 26, 27 if you're married. No, I'm 22 years of age. My wife 
Amy. It'll be 21 next, yeah, next month. 21 next month. And, um, yeah, it is a young age to get married. But when you love someone so much, like, I love, like, my love for Amy is, uncondi like, I think unconditional is the word that I would use. But my love for Amy, every, I never thought I'd be able to love someone as much as what I love Amy. And, you know, she has done so much for me in these past three years. Don't get me wrong. My mum, she's been there for me since, you know, birth. But, you know, <sighs> Amy has done stupidly, like, so much for me. She bought my first moped. She went, she went and got my second moped that I didn't even know about. My third moped, I can't remember putting her house in it or what. I'm sorry, guys, I'm just reading to me. But, you know, she went and bought them stickers for my moped, for God's sake, like. She surprised me with the most random things. Like, for example, I didn't know. I thought these hats were sold out. Syndicate original, like the limited edition one. But no, she managed to um, get me one. Because I didn't have enough money. She managed to get me one. I didn't think that they were selling out. And, you know, it's crazy to think that I met her. Uh, you know, because when I met her, I was at a down point in my life, you know, because... Where I live, when you try to meet like the perfect girl, she always screws up or whatnot. And you know, I was losing home. And when I've met her, and yes, I did meet her at McDonald's when I was when we was working. <laughs> I was like, wow. And I never had that feeling with any other girl like wow. And you know, now I've now I've got that shit. So I'm sort of watching a uh, syndicate's world at the same time. Well, not really. I'll just pause it. But um, you know. <sighs> Every every marriage has their ups and downs, this, that, and the other. But I would never be able to find anyone like Amy. Not that uh, not that I want to, but I'm just saying she is one in a million girl. I can't think of her one in a million lady. I can't thank her enough for what she has done for me in the last three and a half years. It's been absolutely incredible. And you know, because of her, I know that I'm going to have the most, the best life I could ever wish for. And. um she sometimes watches these vlogs, so if you're watching this one, I love you so much, babe. And, you know, here's to a happy future. And, uh, yeah, just please try and put out with my uh, YouTube and my vlogging. <laughs> love you. And, just, yeah, anybody out there, if you're in a relationship and you've been with them, I'd say, for at least a year and a half, and you think, oh, they're the one, pop a finger on her. Pop a, pop a ring on her finger. <laughs> Christ, so I'm just really sweating because it's fucking stupidly hot. I've got a fan full blast. Got windows open, got the door wide. Well, not the front door wide open, got my bedroom door wide open. So, yeah. But anyway, guys, I just wanted to get that all cleared up because so many people ask me why I got married so young. Now I've cleared it up, sank off my chest, and I'm not even using my hand for this. I'm literally got the phone on a tripod, so that's why I can go stupidly long out. But yeah, that's that. Enjoy the rest of the vlog. Thank you for listening. Adios. No, no, why am I saying adios? Thank you for listening. Enjoy the rest of the vlog. Right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm putting a halt to the vlog today. Ugh. <laughs> I just put it on FaceTime to a very, very old... Well, not a very old. <laughs> very friend I've not spoken to in ages. And... And, um... Let's say, this person I'll be... I'm going to see on the 6th of September, so you'll see who it is then. Um, so, yeah. But, anyway. If you have enjoyed today's vlog, please do give it a like rating. Please do subscribe. If you don't know, if you can't subscribe, it's because you've either not signed in or haven't created an account. Create an account. Go on my channel. Subscribe. When it says subscribed, ding on that bell. Like, click that notification bell. And then you're all good to go. Anyway, like I said, sus like, subscribe. Do that bell for notifications. Share it around with your friends, your family, whoever. Don't care. Watch I do. Share it around, guys. Anyway. See you later, guys, and have a lovely British evening or evening wherever you are. I am so tired, so I'm going to get this book up, have some dinner, and then crash. Good night. I'll see you Friday. Friday, okay? Stay tuned for Friday. Bye-bye.